So today we have Mike Domertz come in. Uh, he's a speaker. He talks about sexual assault in a way that the, hopefully the students can really relate to. And we travel the world giving students how-to skills for addressing sexual decision-making, consent, respect, bystander intervention, and supporting survivors. Our work is extremely personal. My sister was sexually assaulted when I was in college, and that drove me to wanting to reduce sexual violence so other families never had to go through this. You know, the key rules are to be able to use your words. If you're in an intimate moment with a partner and you can't talk about it, that means you need to slow down, you need to stop. You should always be able to use your words. The other thing is that you don't engage in intimacy with somebody who's been drinking, with somebody who's drunk. If you really want that person, you think that person wants you, wait till they're sober. Once you get the look, do most people stop and say they act issue or they just go for it? Go for it. All right, let's see what everybody else thinks. Well, he was very interactive to begin with, and he forced us to ask a lot of questions, to think critically about um, what your body language says, but also what the other person actually wants. It forced us to engage what the partner's thinking, what they're saying, and to respect the answer. I think the biggest uh, factoid that we uh, that I think came out of this was just asking questions and being direct. The most important thing I learned was to call three people tonight and let them know that I'll be here for them if they ever want to talk about something that you know happened to them. We have a great website filled with lots of information including videos, articles at datesafeproject.org. Give it up, give me the great, great job,